Hey guys, welcome back to some more Football Manager 2017 and part 2 of Season 6 of Non-League to Legend with Rangers and today we have our first Europa League group match against, uh, well, on camera, against Southampton. So, before we get into things, let's have a look at the last few matches since last episode, which was a 4-2 victory over Hearts. And as you can see, an unblemished record since then. We beat Hamilton 1-0 with Jurda scoring 2-0 against Panathinaikos, I think that's what they're called. Um, I'm really not sure, to be honest. I think it's them. Um, oh, maybe it's not, actually. P-A-O-K. -P <laughs> um, with Ashraf, Ashraf and Jordan Williams on the score sheet. We then beat A United 3-0. Uh, Jeremy Boger and Thierry Ambrose getting a couple there. And then beat Dundee United 3-0. Ryan Gold scoring a penalty, an own goal, and then Ryan Hardy scoring his first goal for a while. And most recently we beat Aberdeen 2-0, Ambrose and Hardy on the score sheet. So that means that we are top of the Premiership table, two points clear of Dundee in second. But more importantly, 13 points clear of Celtic, who are down in 7th place at the moment. Um, we're definitely, you know, uh, looking good. And uh, yeah, it, it should hopefully be uh, another title in the bag for us. <sighs> Squad performances, let's have a look. Top goal scorer is Thierry Ambrose with 9 from 14. Ashraf has scored 5 stunning free kicks. Top average rating is Liam Burt with 4. Uh, a top, a top assist sorry, is Liam Burt with 4. And then th uh, 3 each for Stevenson, Ambrose and Williams. And top average rating is Ashraf with a 7.82. Roshan Williams on a 7.65. Liam Burt with a 7.47 so let's have a look at the team for today then we've got McCrory in goal we've got Ashraf and Barbu Williams and Wallace in defence because uh, Chilwell's out for four months so that's not good um, and Wallace is our only other left back but he's a pretty damn good option um, to go with and we've got Gold, Stevenson and Rossiter in the middle with Liam Bird starting behind Ryan Hardy and Thierry Ambrose up front so hopefully we can get a result at Southampton today. It's going to be tough, but you know, if we have serious ambitions in the Europa League this year, this is uh, certainly going to be uh, a match that's important to look at because Southampton are a top half Premier League side. They're the sort of sides that can go on to win the Europa League, as we showed with Sunderland in the Sunderland project. Um, <clears throat> so, yeah, it's it's a difficult one um, you know, Southampton are obviously a very good side if we beat them convincingly today I think we can compete and Ryan Hardy puts us 1-0 up that's 3-3 three three for him he's certainly had a return to form and that's a brilliant start for us we were passing the, the ball beautifully obviously we've travelled quite a way uh, we'll have probably gone by bus to Southampton um, I might have, got the, might have flew over you never know. Um, but Southampton right at the bottom of the UK Rangers, quite near the top, so yeah. Uh, oh, what's happened here? I don't know, but Ryan Hardy absolutely smacked that into the back of the net. And it's a 1-0. And uh, yeah, good start here for us, but yeah, that left-hand side has looked vulnerable and Zivkovic gets the goal. Mm. Danny Welbeck and then Redmond into the middle. And Zivkovic comes in. Uh, Lee Wallace has been beaten twice there. Already he has... Oh, and Welbeck's put it into the back of the net. 2-1, so a positive early start. Has all gone to crap at the moment. Danny Welbeck now playing for Southampton. Smashes it into the back of the net. And it's 2-1. Hmm. Interesting so far. In interesting game. Obviously, we haven't had many, many shots. Either team... Um, it's just been a couple of lapses in, in concentration at the back that have cost us so far. Ryan Hardy got a brilliant goal early on here. Stevenson now Bert mm, forward to Hardy. I was going to say, but Stevenson Rossiter Gold Bert. Now Liam Bert wouldn't have done that in the Scottish League, but it, it's a much bigger level now, and uh, we have to go and step up our game against the likes of Southampton. Top half. Premier League side for the last 10 years you know uh, here's Stevenson and Ryan Hardy puts us back on level terms he has been on fire 
in the last three matches. Um, somebody got booked there, but it was Ian Stevenson with a through ball. Ryan Hardy volleys it into the top left corner, and it's 2-2. Ooh, this is a tasty match, and obviously Southampton are the best team in the group. So, you know, if we're competing with them, you know, I think we have a good chance of going quite far in this tournament. I am looking for sort of quarterfinals at least, um, if we can get out of the group. Um, that would be good. Because uh, over two legs, I think we can beat anyone. But look at the draw, really. We've obviously got the, the people uh, dropping down from the Champions League as well coming in at round two so that could be literally anybody in Nathan Redmond has put Southampton 3-2 up we are going to make a change right now um, we're going to bring Ambrose off we're going to bring Jurder on and we're also going to bring Liam Burt off because he has been rather rubbish so far Stevenson's been good um, we'll just keep it like that for now hmm does look like Southampton are going to get away with this one. I mean, we have been dominating possession. We've had more shots, more shots on target. So, you know, maybe we could have expected a bit better. But here's Rossiter now on the counter. I was going to say now on the counter attack, but it looks like Southampton are more likely to score. Yeah, and 4-2 would definitely be flattering on them. Oh, and it is 4-2. Clasy on the score sheet. And yeah, 4 2 flatters them a, a little bit. I think it's been a lot more of an even match, but Premier League qu quality finishing there has, has cost us. Um, Ryan Hardy, nope. So that's that. Sorry about that, guys. Um, little interruption there. Sorry. <laughs> um, so yeah, we lost 4 2. I think we actually played alright. Um, you know, just quality of finishing was the difference it'll probably say that on the uh, I don't know cool finishing Southampton prevent upset um, so you know that's that's that uh, we'll obviously have the home game against them coming up now then next uh, episode if we win against Hearts it'll be the League Cup final if not we may well um, play through until well, what, what's the date now um, might actually do the old firm derby uh, if not the league cup final uh, see if Celtic can bounce back so our first defeat of the season um, you know well since the, the real season started so yeah hopefully that doesn't affect confidence too much hopefully you guys have enjoyed pardon this episode please leave a like down below if you did you don't have to of course but enough for me and for the channel Subscribe if you're new and I hope you guys are having a wonderful day. Thanks for watching and goodbye.